What's up, everybody? It's the collector. It's me. I'm back. I got my English Romance Dawn booster box. I know I probably should finish editing the other one I made. I am pretty much almost done editing it, but I just couldn't wait to open this one because these cards I can actually put in my decks. This booster box is... I've been seeing it go for crazy numbers on eBay. It's typically going for around the $200, even the $300 range, no problem. Alright, let's start off with this. What's it going to be? Woo! Who's who? That's a cool card. It's kind of weak, but it does only cost two. But you have to put a down on it, which sucks. All right. Oh, there's the guy with the very unfortunate name. Scratchman Apu from The Simpsons. We got Komachio, Smiley, Koamatsu, B-Bang, whatever that means, Mone, Sheep's Horn. Is that Brooke? Who's he fighting right there? Gene Bart, a Basil Hawkins. We saw this guy in the last video. The Yu-Gi-Oh player. Baroque Works, of course. Ooh. I was gonna say that would go good in my Crocodile deck, but that's uh, purple yellow. Let's see, Sanji. This is a very good card in the meta right now, and it's very affordable. Then we got Drake. Pacifista. You can have, yeah, any number of these cards in your deck, which is wild. We got Krieg. Holdem, the guy that's fighting the line coming out of his trousers. Green Star Rafflesia. We got Mocha. I thought it said Mochi last time. Maybe I thought it said Mocha. I don't know. We got Killer. I haven't met this guy yet in the anime, but... He has a really weird laugh. Damn, he's... <laughs> he's putting Boa Hancock to shame with those titties. They got Radical Frankie Beam. Frankie Radical Beam. Ooh. We got Bartholomew Kuma. Alright, he's a blocker. Play up to one pacifista when he gets KO'd. Oh! This is a very good card to have, guys. This is a very good card. It's cheap has rush and it's powerful for three it's, it's crazy that this rushes that just shows how OP Zoro is Sai Alvida Bao Huang we got Shachi we got Markiplier we got the um, the big brain Bojack Meme, Hyogoro, Goro, Rezo, Daz Bones, Sasaki, Ooh, Uta, on play, add up to one red character card other than Uta with the cost of three or less from your trash to your hand. That could be useful. You can get back that Zoro. Ooh. Alright, super rare. I accidentally called this dude the special art leader that I pulled in Japanese. I thought it was this guy. Um, but the guy I pulled was really Kazuki Odin. And this obviously goes with that leader. Ugh. We got Cavendish. The Prince Charming. Pacifista. Utsuru. Officer Agents. Oh, that's a good... That's good. That's a good counter for a Baroque's Works deck. For the Blurple Crocodile. We got Bellamy. Uh, plot twist with this dude. Did not expect what happened to him would happen. Doflamingo is ruthless. That's all I have to say. We got Overheat. And what's last? Ooh! Ooh, fuck. 
shit, I just creamed my pants a little bit. Holy fuck. Shit. Guys, sound the alarms. Sound the alarms. This is... Fuck. I love that this art. This art is insane. <laughs> I might need to make a Zoro deck. If I, um... Pull that leader. That might be the play. Or I've got to make a red deck. That's the only color I haven't made a deck yet with, is red. As of right now. Well, I did make one, but I don't have a red deck that's currently made. I had to, had to take the Edward Newgate one apart. Um, it's double finger, round table, wire, Kumurusaki, and you got Frankie, the one and only. This character can also attack your opponent's active characters. That's cool. Page one. This character can also attack your opponent's active characters. Nice. And we got Caesar Clown. Whew. I'm loving this box already, guys. If we pull that Shanks, the manga Shanks, um, I will probably like just blip out of existence. Like I just got Thanos snapped or some shit. Artificial Devil Fruit. That's cool. A man-made devil fruit. Interesting to see when I see that in the anime. We got Monkey D. Luffy himself. Queen. Oop. And Okiku. Alright. Subaru again. This old guy, Cavendish again. We got Ice Cube. I guess that's his name, is Virgo. Tch, trying to push his zodiac sign on me. Not cool, bro. Hitokiri Kaz Kamazo. We got Arlong. What? This just took out another leader slot. I don't know how it works, but. I would have got rather have gotten a different leader than Luffy again. Um, this character is good. He's a blocker. Then he also searches, and he's cheap. Okiku again. Where did that Zoro go that I pulled? Shit, I lost him already. I'm gonna have to find that. We got Apu again. Shinobu. We got Speed. Giant Double Ds, we got Kawamatsu, we got Babanuki, Round Table again, Bellamy again, Demon Face, I think that's Guy Fieri right there, Frankie again, Daz Bones again, ooh, Black Maria, ooh, this might be a special, yeah, because there's no border, so this might be an alternate rare. This character cannot be KO'd in battle by strike attribute characters. Alright. Uh, epic. Give this character up to two Rest of Dawn cards. Pretty solid opening so far, I'd say. We got Psy. Pacifista again. Carrot. Shachi. Bartolomeo. Officer Agents again. We got Penguin. He might be related to the Orca killer whale, killer whale dude, but who knows? Ulti Mortar. I can't wait to see her. She seems cool. Rizo. Punk Gibson. And Nami. Solid one drop for sure. Here. Got that dude with a post it note on his face. We got Hadjurdin, Hadouken, and Urashi. You can be my samurai. Girl, we got Markiplier going to play Five Nights at Freddy's. We got in two years. Was this after the time skip or something? 
Um, who's who? The normal who's who. We got Mr. Three sipping his tea. Miss All Day Sunday. And I think that might be something cool in the back. King. All right. We got Virgo. Urashima. This dude with the weirdly shaped long tongue. Nico Mamushi. Fukuoka. These guys' names are way too long. Green Star Raffles. Rafflesia? Yeah. We got Miss Finger Me Double. Paradise Waterfall. Otama. We got Mr. Two. Interesting fellow, but I love him. Um, Kozuki Momo Nosuki with the soft spot on his forehead that I want to use as an ashtray. Ooh! Hoo 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 hoo! Give blue events in your hand minus one cost. That is a. I love Crocodile. He's one of my favorite villains. I can definitely say that. I like his laugh. He's like, ah, 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 ah. Kind of laughs like uh, Marty McFly's dad. Just deeper. Uh, Hayogoro. Crescent Cutlass. That's what he calls that. Right. Wire. We got Jinbi. About to Hadouken. Ashura Doji. Ooh. Toflamingo. You may rest the specified number of down cards in your area. Reveal one card from the top of your deck. If that card is seven warlords, you may play that card rested. That's pretty cool. Can't lie. Then we got another Drake. I say, uh... <laughs> the One Piece is real. Komachio again, Pacifista, Cavendish, Inurashi, Sheep's Horn, Markiplier again, Penguin, Crescent Cutlass, Hirozumi Orochi, Desert Spada. That move was amazing. Then we got Thunder Bagua. Ooh! And then we got the Don for the box. I think so far my favorite one out of these sets, not counting like the double, the new product they have that has the special dons in them, but out of the five so far, I'd say the, the OPO5 has my favorite don when he's fighting Kaido. Smiley. Elephants Marchu. Bartolomeo. Wire again. Brook. We got the artificial devil fruit again. Arlong again. Yeah. Usopp. Draw one card when your opponent activates an event. Interesting. And then Jinbi. Alright, Shinobu. Higurashi. One of the giants. Big brain. Officer Agents, Nico Mamushi, Roundtable, Aizo, S Sasaki, got Frankenstein, we got Drake again, and Captain Kid. That's nice. I want to put him in my Sanji deck, because, yeah, you can rest this character and play a co character cost three or less in your hand, and then when he has a dawn on him, if he's rested, they can only attack this dude, and he has 8,000 power, so they have to waste a lot of Don and cards resources to try to get through it. I think that's a very good card. We got Ice Cube. So many wrappers. I do know that the creator of this game, I mean, uh, of the anime and the manga, a lot of the characters are based off of actors. And even Enel is based off of Eminem. Which I thought was pretty cool. Ooh, the Blurple Crocodile. 
Awesome. We got Beppo and Nico Robin. Cavendish. We got Krieg. Kanjuro. Penguin. Mark. Samurai. Wire again. Archipelago. We got Killer again. Ulti Mortar. And Ulti in the same box. Would you look at that? And Kuma again. So we got some pretty cool stuff. Nothing like that's made me shit my pants so far. Besides the Zoro, I guess. That might have taken up my alternate art slot. But we'll see. We got Speed. We got Carrot. Smiley. Sheep's Horn. Gene Bart. Crescent Cutlass. Brook. Perona. Is this the one that everyone simps for? Not sure. Oh, we got Kaido. When your opponent's character is KO'd, add up to one Dawn card from your Dawn deck and set it as active. That could be good. Interesting how they put two of the same multicolored leaders in the same set. Gum Gum Fire Fist Pistol Red Hawk. Jesus. I forget when he does that, or if I've even seen it yet. And then we got Gecko Moria. Kawamatsu. Hiroshima. Shinobu. Bartolomelo. Nika Mamushi. So many round tables. I think I have a complete set of those by this point. Paradise Waterfall. I don't think we've seen this one yet. Jinbi again. Oops. This dude looks reminds me of the king from Wreck-It Ralph. Jinbi. Once again. Oh! Whew. Woo! The waifu. The waifu is real. She's a blocker, and then when she's attacking or on block, draw one card if you have five or less cards in her hand. I already like that card. Not just because it has a waifu on it, but because it just seems like a good card. We got a poo from The Simpsons. We got Holden. My refrigerator is loud as fuck. It just turned off. Um, uh, two, Mr. Two, we got Drake again. Jeez, how many Drakes can you possibly have? <gasps> oh, the special art. Oh, this took away, this might have taken away the alternate art slot. I don't know. But it's cool. I, I will never complain about getting cool crocodiles. I love me some mommy crocodile. We got Sai, Kenjuro, Nikurashi, Ogoro, Elephant Smarch, Mocha, Mocha, whatever, Bibang, Radical Beam, Kamazo. Oh, we got the Law. This is a good one, too. This might be the play. With those Zoros. I'll do what that other guy was doing to me. And see how he likes it. Taste of his own medicine. And then Black Maria. And the Gum Gum Fire Pistol. Third pack. Third to last pack. Shinobu. Caribou. Creek again. We got Markiplier. I definitely have a full set of him. And that. And this now. Otama. We got the Yu-Gi-Oh! player again, Desert Spada, Gecko Moira, and, drumroll please, <gasps> ooh, 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 is this why, ooh, she has double attack. Alright, cover your ears if you don't want spoilers for OPO6, because they're already out yet. But, is this why the Yamato in OPO6 that was leaked is going to have double attack? Because this card has double attack? Also treat this card's name as Kazuki Odin. Why? Um, 
Double attack. Discard deals two damage. And then it has banish. Are you are you kidding me, bro? Oh, this is this card is awesome. Was this the secret rare for the set? I know this this isn't the uh, the alternate art secret rare. What the fuck? This was corroded. Um, so this isn't the hyper rare one, but still, but still. Can I pull it, Kazuki Odin leader? In English, so I can at least make the deck with him. Because I might, after pulling that. We'll have to see. I wonder if they'll let me use the one I pulled in Japanese. In English tournaments. Because the one... The tournament I play is pretty casual, so they might. Are you kidding me? You give me another Dofi, but you don't give me... <sighs> Why? And last pack. Bless it with the power... Of the one piece. <sighs> All right. Here we go. Utsuru. Bao Huang. Kinjuro. Hayugoro. This guy. Kazuki Odin saying Samurai. Bellamy. Corona. Tony, Tony Chopper. Yes! Mmm! It's the little things in life, guys. It's the little things in life. Um, yeah. That's cool. And then we got Jack. Who is jacked? I think we did pretty well here, guys. Um, Yamato. These are probably the best cards that I pulled today. Especially this one, even though it's it might even if it's not worth too much, it still looks fucking epic. I love that artwork. Props to whoever drew that. Kira Igawa. Good shit, man. It's nice artwork. All right, guys. As always, thanks for watching, and have a wonderful day.